We're going to continue to talk about logarithms today. We've looked at logarithms and how to change them from exponential form to logarithmic form and back. We've evaluated logarithms, but we haven't actually officially talked about them and the special types of logarithms that exist. So logarithms are defined as the log base b of y equals s or x if and only if b to the x equals y. So that's how we translate them, right? We have what's called the common log. Up until now, in your log minutes, you've only dealt with log base 2, log base 3, and log base 4, and you translated different log bases. The common logarithm is defined as log base 10. This is what your calculator does. That log button on your calculator only does log base 10. And it doesn't write a base for that. <coughs> so we just write log of x, and this means the log base 10 of x. That's what it means when you see log without a base down there. Okay. Imagine how many buttons they would have to have on your calculator if they had a button for every different base that was possible. Is that possible? No. So that's why your calculator only has one log button, and it's the common log. We'll talk later about how to use that for other logarithms. So can you tell me what the log of 100 is? It's not 10. What is it asking us? 10 to what power equals 100, and so it's 2. Okay, because this means 10 to what equals 100. So the log of 1 tenth means 10 to what equals 1 tenth. What's the answer for that? Negative 1. We talked a little bit yesterday about the natural logarithm because we had to find the E button on the calculator. The natural logarithm is log base E, and we write this LN, natural log. Again, we don't write log E. Okay, this means log base E, but we don't write that. We just write ln of some numbers. So what is the natural log of E? E is 2.718. But if it's log base E of E, what is the answer? 1. The natural log of E is 1. And because this is asking E to what power equals E. That's what it's asking. This one's asking E to what power equals E to the second power. So the answer is 2. Okay. 